Okay, greetings YouTube land and welcome back to another showcase video. Uh, this one's a little different. It's for Fallout 76 and it is not of a, you know, like a, a typical uh, player home or anything like that. This is in 76 and it's a home of someone named TJ357, uh, I think his name was. Um, and I kind of wish I did this from the beginning, but uh, I'm glad I actually was able to contact him. Uh, you know using the headset and mic the uh, chat here is a little weird like you can only oh god it is it night okay so here let me see here where am I okay hold on I think I actually have to travel to him so hold on okay social Oh, shit. Wait. You declined. Target is too close. Crap. Okay, hold on here. Hey. Hey, there you are. Hello? Can you hear me? Okay. Oh, very good. Yeah, okay, up? okay. Okay. Um, so I'm like in a... Oh, wow. Uh-oh. Hello? Jesus, it just kicked me out of the game. Okay, yeah, it just kicked me out of the game, guys. So, hold on. This is like the second time this has happened to me. Social. Okay, what, what else do I have to do here? What? And how come I'm not where the house is? try to figure out how to get back to um, uh, TJ uh, yeah TJ 357 so hold on here join Ugh. Why is it so hard to, like, get together with someone in here? Okay, invite to team. Jesus. Do I have to fast travel? Fast travel? Okay. How many times do I have to fast travel to someone, you know? Hello, hello, hello. Okay, looks like we're in the same team. Oh, wait, I'm muted, I think. What the f... Okay, hold on. Audio. Push to talk. Team. Okay, here we go. Ah. Okay. You, you can fast travel right to me. This is good. Back oh, okay. Yeah, the last time, it just kicked me out of the game. I don't know. <laughs> okay, um, so fast travel again. All right. Is my uh, voice coming out okay? You can hear me okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what you built, this is, oh, look at that. This is incredible. Check it out, man. It's a pre-war house. That was the idea. Yeah. Um, by the way, do you just go by TJ, or... I, I go by Falagar. Uh, I'm TJ, that's me. 
just TJ. Okay, very cool, very cool. Uh, yeah, so guys, yeah, this is, uh, he's level 203, TJ 357. And we're about to take a tour uh, at his pre-war house. Okay, uh, lead on. And if you like, you know, you can go ahead and, and narrate and stuff like that. This is fantastic. Yeah, sure. We, uh, we're living uh, right next to the town of Helvidia uh, here in West Virginia. So, got the banner up. <laughs> oh, nice, nice. Shop function out here, easy to find for people if they don't feel like going out. Oh, okay. Keep in mind, I'm still very new to this game, so as you can see, I'm only level well, 6. Well, you've made a good choice, sir, because this is a great community and a great game. This is my kitchen. Excellent. Go enjoy. Check it out. I just can't yeah. shake these nightmares. Living in space forever. Just oh, look at that. It has like a light. It says like Nuka-Cola. Where's that coming from? Oh, okay. It's coming from the bottle. Okay. And here we've got the uh, living room. Is there a way to walk in this game? Um, I, with a joystick, it's just a subtle touch. Ugh, okay. Let me see. Let me go to uh, controls here. Oh, okay. So it'll always run. Okay, this is good. So I'm like moving too fast. Here we go. Now, I have experience with Fallout 3 and Fallout 4, but still new to this, so it, it looks well, familiar, um but. 76 is built on the same engine as Fallout 4 with some modern improvements. Um, mm. So you'll notice a lot of the you know, reused assets from the, from yes. the previous game. Yes. Yes. Like this right here. Someone created a mod that actually improved on the magazine racks, and you're able to fit, I think, like 10. I just can't shake these nightmares. Yeah, this is fantastic. I take it you've played uh, three and four, probably New Vegas as oh, well. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Nice. Yeah, seventy six is good because the community is good, and uh, you know, Fallout games are obviously single player experiences, but the uh, multiplayer aspect here is only positive. Oh, excellent. Oh, look at that. Now, most of this stuff here, did you craft them, or they have to kind of be purchased in the Atomic well, Store? Well, you, you got to find plans in Fallout. Okay. Um, a lot of this stuff in here I had to go out and look for. Uh, there's tons of wikis and guides online to look for specific things, but uh, most of this stuff is uh, easily obtainable by anyone. Nice, okay. Okay, let's go on to another room. Oh, look at the, uh, the Shamrock one. I think it, this is a luck one, right? Yeah, I'm still powder. working on finding all of them. I haven't found them all. <sighs> Bobbleheads are a little different in, in 76. Uh, they're actually a, a consumable. Uh, that's gonna give you a yeah, that's a what while. it seemed like. But, you know, I still wanted to collect one of each as a display as well. Okay, so like say when you collect them, so you use it, it will, it will disappear from this? Well, no, you, so you can find multiples of the same one. So basically, oh, I like, see. I've got I've got one here so that I can have a display of all of them. But like I found oh. several agility ones that uh, at times are you know something that I'm gonna pop and give me a buff for an hour or whatever. Okay, so like say you have five, just use four of it and then keep keep one up here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. These I are see. actually like yeah. uh, they're like locked into a different screen so that I can't accidentally use them as well. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's like you're only missing six more. <laughs> yeah. So we got a hallway in here. This is my crafting room here. Um, it's uh, it's got everything in it. Kind of cramped, but you know. It I just works. can't shake these nightmares. Just so everyone knows, this is all built from scratch. Just you know, so if you're familiar with the Fallout 4, um, you know, settlement building, 
this seems like it's kind of like the same but it seems like it's it looks a lot more detailed or a little bit more detailed at, at least you know if, if you don't use mods with uh, or if, if you use mods with Fallout 4 but so this this was uh, not here before and all of this was constructed and decorated yeah the whole house is running on a fusion generator back in the maintenance room here oh yes this is what you were showing me yeah look at this I'm also brewing and uh, fermenting some booze there as well oh nice yeah look at that that hidden nuke cola door huh yeah, I, I love that. Yeah, I was looking inside thinking, oh, you have to pick it just to get a Nuka-Cola, huh? But there's more to it. Yeah, let's go on headed upstairs. Yeah, my channel name is Let Us Play. Two words spelled L-E-T-T-U-C-E, -E, like the uh, vegetable. And it's on YouTube. You're probably going to find several, but mine... Uh, my icon is, it says Felagar. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, I wish, uh, f for the, the chatting in here, I wish you could also type, you know, just like with ESO or Diablo or something yeah, like that. Yeah, they, they it's just all... to go the route of not, of not doing the typing. I think, you know, I, it makes a lot of sense for, you know, from a console perspective, but from a P mm. PC perspective, it is a little strange, yeah. Yeah. I, I, I was trying to do that. I, I met like a few other nice people, but I just at the time I wasn't. I didn't know how to communicate, and that's when I, f I figured yeah, out. Yeah, I, it was just. I feel like uh, I feel like it's kind of nice not to have a chat, though. I think there's some benefits mm. to that. Oh, I see. I just can't shake these nightmares. In here, uh, so Fallout 76, we have uh, allies that you can get uh, that'll kind of hang out and live at your camp at your house uh, here. Okay, and like the settlers in Fallout 4. Quests. They oh, have yeah. some rare unlocks, that kind of thing. So in here you've got, uh, this is my uh, mainframe laboratory where my ally is working for me. Oh, good little that. worker bee. Oh yeah, okay, Always here's nice one of them right here. here. Oh, really nice, I'm able to, Pardon okay. Me. Now, do you actually have vendors in here? Uh, no, this is just uh, like a computer mainframe and like file storage kind of thing. Okay. I meant, but I meant, like, in general, are you able to get vendors to sell? sell oh, yeah. Things? My, my vendor's come visit? outside on the porch. That's what that, uh, that computer the thing is. In the world. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, People I'm selling a bunch of weapons and apparel right now. It's Mamo. Oh, nice, nice. Then here we got the, uh, got the hallway in the bedroom. Oh, yeah, look at that. The 76 rug. DJ lifting weights. Yeah, and uh, these display cases, you can put them up and put pretty much anything you want in them. I've got a couple downstairs as well. Uh, found some unique uh, Mr. Fuzzy stuffed animals, so I've oh. got those for collective sake. They're just junk, but you can display whatever you want. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like that. This is like a, well, I was going to say like a kid's room, but but yet there's, or is this your room? <laughs> it's the only room there is. Yeah, it's oh, just the only there's room. toys and shit around, because there's uh, stuff unlockable, plushies, yeah. and models, and stuff you can find. Oh, th this is fantastic. Looks like we have, is that Captain wow. Cosmos, uh, Grog, Grognak, Myster uh, Mysterious Stranger, and just a Super Mutant? Unless that's strong from Fallout 4, but no, I don't think so. He doesn't have a his brain is not exposed yeah, just a like super that. Super mutant in a silver shroud, yeah. Now that that can be attainable in game, or is that again atomic store stuff? So that uh, those little dolls on the top shelf there, those are atomic shop. But uh, all the okay. little Mr. Fuzzy dolls and that little frog in the jar there, for instance, the globe, those are all attainable oh, yeah. uh, just for the game. Oh, yeah! I didn't even notice that frog. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, that's my prince and the frog. In the jar. <laughs> oh, very nice. Okay. And most importantly, out of all, we've got the uh, the functional bathroom. Ah, yeah, yeah. And here we 
go. Look at that. I was taking a shower in here earlier, but you can literally see. Unlike in Fallout 4, you actually will go. Through, oh, hold on. You would go through the animation of going into the shower, as you can see right here, and you're putting up the curtain. Very, very cool stuff. Well, you'll notice as you pop around uh, getting into this game that you're gonna, people are going to build all kinds of different kind of crazy bases. Bunkers and towers and ridiculous mm -hmm. monster structures that defy gravity. But yeah. I don't know, I like, I like me a good uh, period uh, pre-war house. Exactly. And you know, to be quite honest, I didn't... Because I've seen some things, but I, I kind of seen like a few of the weird stuff um, that you're talking about. And I did not know it was really possible to make it like what you have just built right here. I mean, this looks like, to be quite honest, like a house that would have been already originally created for the game. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't look like it's something... after I got out of the vault, That's... You know? <laughs> I just it's unbelievable that this is all built by you and it's not part of the game and you just kind of either just added yeah, some you, decorations you wanna, to you it. You want to see something real crazy, bud? Watch Fantastic. It. Yeah. Are you going to like f do a flip? What the Is it a so compact home? No, so, so what I've done... No, no, it's all built. All pieces, okay. just like in the Fallout 4 settlement building. Oh, foundation okay. Foundation piece, walls, everything. Now, what I've just done is I've activated a secondary camp. So you can have several camp slots. Oh. Lots where this is this is my main house, like my pre-war house, but I also have a base way over in the Cranberry Bog that's like a bunker with lots of turrets because there's lots of enemies around. And I got another cabin up in the, up in the snowy hills near the ash heap that I can activate oh. one of... What I've done here is just turned off the house, so you can see what the land looked like. I before see. I got here. Right. Okay. Hold on. Let me let me take a step back over here, um, just so we can can get like a full panoramic of. Look at that, guys. You see, before the yes, house was I, I came put across in there. this piece of land, it was like this will do. This will do. Were, were you able to, because I, I don't remember exactly where it's situated, but that tree, that big tree over there, or like poles, are you able to take those away or scrap them? Or, so, um, uh, everything you can pretty much move except trees that are that big. Um, that tree was there. The house is just pressed up against it. Oh, I see. Okay. Here, but when you say like... on the road, I'll turn it back on. Okay, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let me get back out a little bit more. Okay, let's see it. Oh, look at that. Materializing right before our eyes. Look at that. Oh. See, I'm, I am glad I'm recording this. This is, you know, if there's like other newbies out there and they check this out, they can actually see the, you know, newbies like myself. Uh, they can actually check out the extent of what you can build, what is yeah, possible, possible in this you game. Know, you Amazing. See one more thing, though, bud. It's this Jesus. Oh, wait, I think, did I come in, did I just come in, go in here? I, I went into something like this, and there was a, uh, yeah, yeah, and then, mm -hmm. and there's a, so, uh, this thing here, this symptomatic, it didn't do anything for me, I thought it was going to get rid of my radiation, but. Oh, it gets rid of uh, diseases. That's oh, diseases, okay. But anyway, so, um, so you got your you got your, your your base plot where you can set your building area and you can build. Uh, unfortunately, there is a building limit. Now, obviously, you've seen what I've done. And, yeah. You know, there's That's lots a lot. of room for what you want to do. You can build super tall or whatever. But eventually, mm -hmm. there is a lot of shit in this game that people want to try to do. So they gave us these shelters. So these are called vault utility shelters. There's several of them. There's, oh. there's abandoned mine shafts and old missile silos that you can unlock and that you can get that, that are that instead of this vault utility shelter. But basically, everybody gets these shelters that have infinite building capacity in them. Um, but so to get something like do, this, do you have to be a, a, a first a first member? Uh, yes. Okay. I, no, I think you can get the basic thing without it. Because I okay. wasn't a Fallout first member at first, I am now. But like, like if you look in here, um, this is really what it is. Because I've just got it blocked off because I'm not using it right now. But um, you get yeah, this, actually, I get in this here. substantial amount of space to do, you know, whatever you want. You can put walls up and cover up all the vault stuff and make it look like a room or a house or what have you. And some of the other shelters are massive to the point that you could build 
three or four story buildings on the inside of the shelter room because Jeez. they're so big. I just have the small one because most of my shit's upstairs, you know. Yeah, right, right. So it's good that you can have both, you know, this and. Yeah, and most people what you do have use there. both. I just I don't use this yet. Uh, I've only been playing Fallout for about two months, so I'm still oh, only two months, and and look what you've you've built already. Oh, yeah. Well, thank and two oh three your level. <laughs> I did a lot of Fallout 4 building, so that's a good foundation for uh, doing it yeah. here because it's, it's one and the same. Yeah, I've, I've delved a little bit into the settlement building, but never anything, nothing like this in 4, you know. And I'm also glad I added you as a friend. You know, I'm part of... Um, um, I don't know if you use Facebook at all or if you just wanted to create one for this purpose, but I'm part of a like a gaming guild, a gaming movie guild. You know, we're just about like 56, 57 members. If you're interested, you know, it's just you don't even have to post anything if you don't like. You can just be like a fly in a wall type thing and just kind of look and see what people post, like their videos or creations, like stuff like this. Like, you know, taking toy yeah, videos I'll would get, like go uh, up there. I'll get the info from you later. I mean, we're oh, sure. We yeah, yeah. Find you. Oh, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, we, we have some mod authors from Fallout 4 as well. I don't know if this game can be modded. Probably not, because it uh, is not, a... Not legally. Well, not, not legally. Not <laughs> the yeah, right yeah. word. Um, uh, it's against the game's rules. You know, yeah, um, yeah. To, to use most mods. It's not, a, it's not officially supported. Although I uh. know of a lot of cosmetic mods that people use that they don't seem to have a problem with. But personally, mm. I know mods, not the yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I I like the mods that not not really change the game so much, but just mostly add for immersion. Yeah, and like what dude, you said, cosmetic stuff. A lot stuff, of that immersion yeah. stuff that Fallout 4 needed mods for, Bethesda yeah, has provided in a little for this bit. game. I'm, I'm taking a tour. Yeah, it's money, but you know, a lot of the a lot of the the good stuff is is from these seasonal rewards, which don't cost anything. Yeah, like the play. past like, Christmas and Halloween. There's been. What, what are these? Oh, this thing. Oh, it's nothing, just a... Oh, okay, guess. Holes in your pockets. I got to oh, okay, so here's a merchant right out here. It's too wet to be outside. Okay. And this is your specific merchant right here, right? No, no, this is actually a random encounter. This traveling merchant has just appeared oh. uh, at my base nice. near the road. So that's just oh, by nice. chance. Okay, let me sell some stuff then. This is uh, very good. My vendor is this computer over here. If you if you come to this little locker chain and click on it with A or your interact button, probably E. Um, I'm left-handed, sorry. <laughs> uh, but it, you can see all the shit I'm selling over here. Okay, let me... Um... I think that's... Let me sell this one. And let me see if I can hook you up with a half decent gun. Let me go see what I got. Okay. And where was your merchant? You said. Sorry about that. I was getting rid of some, clearing up some weight. Oh, is it cool if I take this purified water you have over here? Yeah, it's a it's a water cooler. It, it, it oh, that's nice. Yeah, so right here, if you come over here and interact with the vending machine, that's going to be my, my personal shop that I'm selling to other players. I see, so it's not an actual person. This is, uh, okay, nice. Oh, nice. there are other shop cosmetics. Like, there's one that there's there's a protect a protect on robot one you can do, but I just like this one because it's mm. right against the wall. Right, okay. Oh, yeah, I like that. I don't have the, uh, the caps yet, but, uh, <laughs> oh, man. I can, I can afford this Arcto slap coat, but wow. Some Halloween decorations. This is yeah. I just I have to say you you have done an exemplary job with this place. Super impressive. Clean up this. Fix that. Uh, is there a name of this place, or do you actually name it? Let me check the map and see. It's just, okay, just your name. Oh, here, okay. Just TJ's uh, Camp. Okay. So that way, you know, I can title the video uh, the name of your settlement.
Oh, maybe I'm too far away. Can you hear me still? I'm trying to get to you. I just can't shake these nightmares. Oh, here. Okay. Floating in space forever. When we were like spread apart like that, are uh, you still able to hear me? Do I have to be next to you or um? It'll it'll fade out a little bit. But it'll uh, fade out a little. Distance, okay. It's an area chat. Yeah. I see. Okay. Oh, nice responders, weapons, bench. What are you building? I am actually making you a decent firearm. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah. Okay. Very cool. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, no. Take your time. Yeah. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you. Pick your perk. Oh, nice. This one? Oh yeah, yeah. I saw this one. Okay, I've seen it all. Here, I got it for you out here on the porch. Oops. Kind of Attention, lost. citizens. Nuclear strike lost imminent. a little bit. Please exit the area at your earliest convenience. Thank you for your cooperation. Ah, very nice. Oh, hey. Oh, God. Yeah, it's, oh, that's uh, it's maxed out. Like, it's, it's for level 5, because you know, yeah. it's now, but I, I maxed out all the, uh, the mods on, so it'll be good. I just can't shake these huge, things. huge. Thank you for that, man. Yeah, you shouldn't go into the wasteland alone in a suit. Come on, you need a gun. Why? Yeah. I, well, it's not showing up, but I did put on, um, what is it? I think it was just like light, light plate or something like yeah, oh, light so, or yeah, leather, you, leather you chest piece. You are covering up your armor by wearing under armor, so that are by wearing over armor. So basically, like to quickly explain that, um, you can wear an outfit over top of any armor. Yeah, there you go. See, now you're yeah. in a bald suit with a little bit of leather. When you put yeah. an outfit, like a clothing outfit on, it adds no defense or anything, but it makes mm -hmm. you look like you're wearing it. Like, look at me. I look like I'm in this black coat, right? But look what I really right. look like. Oops. Oh hey, you're using a power armor, is it? Or is that no, it? no, that's uh, not power armor. It's just like really yeah. good armor. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Because see, power armor for because I'd rather be in a nice coat than not this bulky eat. white armor. Exactly. Okay, and of course you're still getting the defense and stuff like that from the armor. Yeah, yeah, you just—it's yeah, yeah. just like it's underneath of this, you know. Sure. Okay. Yeah, this suit I believe was one. I, I claimed it as like a. Yeah, it's, a reward it's free or something, right now. It's a free and then, reward. yeah, very nice. Okay, um, do you have any anything else to showcase before I close this out? The video. Uh, no. Uh, thanks for taking an interest in my in my my house, man. Uh, I'm doing a lot of building right now. I'll probably have some more shit to show. Later. Oh, absolutely. Anytime you have, you know, if you have like a new settlement later on to show or like in the future or just anything just to showcase your character or something, uh, you know, cool that you got for him, uh, just let me know and then I'll be more than happy to, to, to film it or record it and then put it up on YouTube. Yeah, man, it's thanks for showing interest. The only thing I really want to say to anybody that's watching this that uh, is an avid Fallout 76 player. This is an Enclave Plasma Flamer with all the right mods on it. Man, did I get lucky. This thing's a fucking... Oh, yeah, yeah, you were using that. What do you mean you got lucky? It well, dropped for you? Like I said, if, you're, if anybody watching's a Fallout 76 player, then they'll understand how ridiculously stupid hard it is to put this weapon oh, together. Oh, really? Right? Oh, man, yeah, okay. You can't, you can't craft it or any of the mods for it. It's a, it's, oh. a special weapon. You have to find the mods. And man, is it a bitch. Oh, Jesus, okay. So, uh, uh, an event... Oh, shit, the nuke just went off. Event uh, just uh, 
started. I'm going to go hop into that event. I do yeah. not recommend you follow me because you're No, no. I <laughs> I'm going to I'm probably going to take a little break. I'm going to have some dinner. I got to cook up some dinner and then and then have right, well, I'm going to take care of Earl. You have yourself a good day. We'll, uh, we'll You talk too. Later, okay. Okay, and just when you check out my Facebook, uh, I'll you know if you leave a comment there on the, on this video or any other video that you see up there, I will give you the the Facebook information, and you can go ahead and join that. Okay, yeah, man, oh. uh, enjoy that gun. Okay, we'll do. Thank you again, TJ. Very great to meet you, man. You too. Thanks.